hi you guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video for today i don't think i've ever done a video like this and i have no idea what made me want to i think i'm just getting in like my handbag purse era or something i've never been into purses it's just not something that has excited me or anything that i've wanted to invest in before i look at them and i can admire the beauty in them and like i see people like carrying certain bags and i'm like oh my god that bag is beautiful i just don't know what it is i never think about buying a bag i never think about browsing a bag selection i never think about adding a new bag to my collection until recently i don't know what it is i think it's because i've been like kind of narrowing down my personal style and what i really 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 like and i've just gotten to a point I, I don't know if it's age i don't know if it's just like personal i don't want to say growth or development because that's not at all what it is but i am just getting more and more to the phase of like refining my personal style and really only having things in my closet that i absolutely love not things not i don't want to say not things that are trendy because there are still some trends that i really really like but just really 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 focusing on only the things that i like it doesn't matter how many people are wearing them it doesn't matter how good somebody else might make it look if it's not something that i see myself wearing all the time it's just something that i don't want in my closet and lately i feel i have felt like my bag selection could be improved but i also am not like a huge designer bag lover i don't care for luxury handbags specifically i just i never have all these bags that i have are from the really affordable end all the way to i only i have one like real designer bag and it was a gift so like all these bags are very, very affordable for the most part, say like under $100, pretty much all of them, but they look so good. They are ones that like make me excited to wear them and I get really happy to pair them with my outfits. They get me excited about accessorizing when like I'm not a big accessories person. My favorite accessory is usually like my shoe, but now I don't know what it is. Like I said, I'm getting into the bag, the handbag, the clutch world i wanted to show you guys all of my personal favorites i have more up in my closet but these are ones that are just exciting me at the moment some of them i've had for a little while some of them are newer because i have just recently started adding to this little collection that i have so any of these i'll just start off by saying if they are not available anymore or if i can't find them i will try my best to find as similar as i can or ones that are very 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 close in style so i am wearing today these earrings are anna luisa these hoops right here and then both of these dangly chain ones are from amazon all of this stuff i will link down below and i do have a coupon code for anna luisa that i will link down below as well um just so everything is like in one space my necklace it's a little k initial it is also from anna luisa um all this is super super old my rings are catbird and then my engagement ring and my wedding band um and then this little dress is from brenda lynn and cora i love it i wear a size medium i'll leave it linked down below for you guys but it's like this really cute utility style dress and i just it's so cute i love it with like a cute little pair of sneakers it's very very cute so let's get into my current handbag favorites so this first one i'm starting off because i know for sure it's not available anymore because it's from brenda lynn and cora from I don't even know if it was last year or the year before, but it is this really, really cute. It's not raffia. It's very, it's very close. Um, this is what it looks like right here. So with this tiny little, uh, like, I don't even know, like slouchy clutch thing. It's pretty small. It's not a big bag at all. It's like, here's the length of my iPhone. It's a little bit bigger like it very very comfortably fits fits like my phone my wallet everything in there but i wear this bag all of the time and it also does come with a crossbody strap i am a small bag girl i like small bags clutches i don't carry a lot in my wallet i only have like a card holder so all my stuff is very small so i don't care for bigger bags unless it's a bag that i'm going to work if i'm going to a coffee shop or if i'm going to the hq or if it's a meeting or something then i'll carry a bigger bag but almost all these bags are very small in like 
the scheme of bags. So why I love this bag. One, I love this fabric for the um, spring and summertime. This is like the perfect spring and summer texture. I think it gives personality to any of your outfits. It goes with neutrals really, really well. Like an all white outfit with this bag is just super, super pretty. I know 100% that they have very similar ones on Etsy. So I will link those options down below. I'll link a couple different options in case you want to see one versus the other. But I love, 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 love this bag. It is just so cute. It again, matches everything. It's very, very timeless because of the texture and I love, I think this like is like a Bottega shape or style, like their type. I'm not, like I said, I'm not really like into bags like that. So it isn't something that like, I know where something is inspired from if it is, but it has this hard part here with like a metal like detailing and this just like snaps shut. And then this is the size of it. I don't, there's just my, I don't know what this is. It's a Saint Laurent something, I don't know. And then there's just change in here from the last time I used it, but it fits a decent amount. Like I said, I don't carry a lot, so it'll fit like this. It'll fit my sunglasses. It'll fit my camera if I take it, my lip products, my keys, my wallet. It fits everything that I need. And again, it has a little crossbody. So in case I do want to wear it like this, which I normally don't, I normally like carrying pouches like that, that's just my style, but I love, love, love this bag. It's not available anymore on our site, but I will find alternative options that are very similar. I'll keep a couple down there just so you guys can browse if this type of style is something you really like. But I love this bag and I used it all last summer and I'll definitely be using it a lot this summer as well. So next up is actually a find that I found while I was working with a client, Gabby, who was the very first client that ever hired me, she's the one that pushed me to start my styling business. Um, I was sourcing for her for her bachelorette party. And while I was, that was the time where I was wearing like the orange and pink combination all the time. If you go on my Instagram, which I'll leave my Instagram down below as well, I was wearing hot pink and orange every single outfit like I was addicted to it right now I have I have transitioned into a different color combo but I was just obsessed so she had told me um she sent me a picture of her wedding flowers and her wedding flowers had oranges and pinks and I was just like oh my god this like speaks to the color story that I've been like really obsessed with so when I was sourcing for her I found this bag and I loved it so much that I was like I want it for myself I was obsessed with it so this is what it looks like right here it's an acrylic little clutch it is like this plasticky acrylic. It has this detail on the top, like this little thing. This doesn't do anything. It just helps you like open the bag. So it is obviously hard. So when you open it up, it is completely black on the inside and it comes with a gold chain that you can detach if you want to. I have it on there from, I don't remember. I think we were in Puerto Rico or something when I wore it, but I, like I said, I personally like to wear clutches as clutches. So inside of this, let me see if I can show you guys. It fits my phone, but it is something that like you're fitting like your phone, your card. Let me see if I can put like as much as I can in there. Okay, so right now in here is my iPhone and my wallet. I can't fit like um, a lip product in here. Normally, most of the time I'm holding my phone anyway. Like I'll be like this because I just like to have my phone in my hands. Um, but that is kind of like what fits in here and I just have a card holder like that's just what I carry because I just don't need a big wallet I have one I just don't really use it ever um, but I actually got this on Amazon and I normally don't do I don't buy a lot of like fashion stuff on Amazon every once in a while I will but I'm just not drawn to it really but I saw this and it came in so many colors that I loved Every single time I'm sourcing, if I'm looking for a really cool color scheme, I always look for really cool acrylic bags because they're not leather, so it's not like you're getting like a fake or cheapy leather. It's just acrylic, like a nice acrylic. And I love, again, this color combo. So now every single time I wear hot pink or orange, I wear this. Even if I'm not wearing those colors and this is just something that I really like how this color story goes with, I pair it and I love it. So I will link this down below for you guys. I think this was like... Un it definitely was under 30 bucks. I can't remember the exact price because I've had it for a little bit, but I love this so, so, so much. Next up is a newer bag to my collection, but it's something that I've wanted for a very long time. And that's the only reason that I'm putting it in a favorites 
because it is so new i haven't gotten to wear it a ton but it's a style that i've wanted for a really really long time and i am the type of person i use pinterest for everything like literally for everything for home for cooking for fashion for inspo for all of that and i noticed that in my things that i wanted to add to like my wardrobe i kept being drawn to bags that were like this i don't know if you're able to see it there we go like that like that one specifically is like a ysl bag but i was just so drawn to this like i don't even know what it's called it's like i just really loved this leather and straw <laughs> i don't know i don't i don't know what the fabric is called i need to look into it but like i just loved it and i kept pinning it and for me whenever i notice myself pinning something over and over and over and over again it's something that i really have my eye on and I, I i'm not an impulsive shopper like i'm someone that if i'm looking at something i will literally sit there forever just thinking about it thinking about it thinking about it so i went on etsy and i have been on like my etsy craze lately like i've been very very into shopping small shopping handmade from all over the world i just i find it so much more unique and fun versus like just going to zara and getting something that's like i don't want to say mass produced because in the grand scheme of things like we all shop at places like that and buy things like that but this is the bag right here and this is from a brand called miuchia i'm not sure if i'm pronouncing that right studio and this is handmade in indonesia in bali and i i knew i knew this is the type of bag that i wanted it is a clutch but it does come with a little strap that i most likely will not use i i, I don't think i will just because i like the way that this looks as a clutch it looks very very expensive i think with shipping because it was coming from overseas i think it was like 70 dollars. and again that was with the shipping which was a higher cost for shipping because it was traveling so far but just it has such little pretty details like the little pole the little um leather thing that hangs there all of the details like all of the the finishes are like a very like a brush brass it's not super shiny which i like because that means you can wear it with whatever color metal you want and then it has this black leather going all throughout the stitching is really really even and just symmetrical like it looks very very well made i love this little detail down here i just really like the details of it and then um in here you can obviously fit a ton your wallet your lip gloss probably a hand cream like it fits a good amount so i'm really really happy with this i feel like this is something that i will wear every single year for both spring and summer it's just again it's so easy with an all black outfit with an outfit that has like pops of black i really like it and it came in a lot of different colors there's another bag that i want that it's made in greece i want it so bad but i just keep sitting there looking at it looking at it looking at it i will wait if it's something that i really want over time then one day i'll get it but i really really love this bag so much and it also in the packaging came in this little dust bag thing next up is an actual like crossbody bag like a real life crossbody bag and this one i actually bought at target and i'm not sure if you can tell but i this is like my favorite texture i don't i don't know if it's straw i this one i think is straw because i have raffia i have i have so many different of this same type of texture but i freaking love this bag i have worn this bag so much the only con to it is that this leather like thing or plastic because i know this isn't real leather it doesn't cover the entire top so if you like lay your bag down something small will spill out of it but i don't really care because i don't carry a lot of my bag anyway but i got this bag from target and i'm just in love with this fabric like i said like this texture because i feel like it brings so much personality to summer outfits this is from the universal thread brand and i just love it it goes with every single one of my neutral outfits I don't wear neutrals too often to be honest like i'm always usually in colors i love color but if i'm wearing like all white all black beiges browns creams i just love this even when i'm wearing other colors i just throw this on and i love it it has a small zipper on the inside i think this bag was like under 30 dollars too it has a small zipper on the inside so if you need to put something that might fall out in there you can and this fits a lot like i put my 
phone in there. I can put this. I can put my camera. I can put my lip products. I can put everything that I need. It's very, very big. And I just feel like it's really cute, especially for like a beach, a beachy type summer or just summer overall. It also came in black, like with this being black. And I really liked that one as well, but I knew that I was going to get this one. So that's why I opted for the brown for this. But I love this. I definitely recommend it if you are looking for a summery time bag. It's just so pretty. It goes with everything. This is something that will never go out of style because of the simplicity of it. And it gives a really cute, like, um, not, I don't want to say bohemian. I don't, I don't know the word to describe it, but it's just, I love it. It's so, so, so cute. And I feel like if you wanted to, I'm not sure if it could be carried as a clutch. I want everything to be a clutch, to be honest. Like you could technically like hold it like this, which I think is really cute as well. Highly recommend, um, especially for just like a really cute, affordable summertime little bag. Next up is my only designer, like high-end designer bag. And it is, it was my Christmas gift from Tyler. And it is my only black bag. I don't really have a lot of bags, um, but this is, I don't even know what it's called. It's a Saint Laurent little bag and it's a crossbody. I, I know that it has a name, I just don't remember what it is. And like I said, I'm not really into bags like that. So I'm like, I don't know nothing. But this is like my dressy evening bag. If we're going out to like a really nice dinner and I'm wearing black or if we're going somewhere like nice and I'm wearing black, this is usually the bag that I will take because again, I don't really have another black bag. He knows that I like small bags. I am not a big purse person, which you can see by this collection. I like little bags because I don't need a big bag. Like I don't need it for anything. Um, but this one carries literally everything that I need. There's stuff in here from the last time I carried it. Mail, there's some cash in here, there's keys. It carries a pretty decent amount, especially for what I need it for. Like it carries my, again, my bat, my phone, my lip products, my wallet. It carries everything that I need. He picked it out himself and I love that. It's the only designer bag, like I said, that I have. And it's something that I would never get rid of because it's so simple, very, very timeless. It's black. Like it's, it's just so easy to wear. Now for a big bag. And this was actually a gift from Brendalyn and it was so thoughtful and just random because I don't know, we had never, <laughs> I don't know. She just, she, it was so nice of her when she was like, oh my God, I got you something. So she was like, this is like a, uh, we, we just made like five years in business. So she was like, this is your gift from me. Um, and this is from a brand called Proenza. Um, it's a very, very, uh, I don't wanna say old brand, but it's been around forever. And this is what it looks like right here. It's obviously in my favorite colors. I love all of the colors that are like it has. It has these black big straps. So like this is how I would carry it if I was gonna put my laptop, if I was going to work, I could carry my food in here. This is like a huge bottomless pit. It's massive and it comes with a little clutch. I haven't even taken the tag off of it. The designer right there, Proenza. And in here it has like you can carry all of your cards, it has like card slots in there, which I think is awesome. And I just love, again, my favorite color is blue. So like I will carry this whenever I'm wearing like a cute outfit that I wanna wear blue. This is like the perfect little clutch to carry it with. And it just goes like right inside of here. And then this is, like I said, it's a big bottomless pit. I have stuff in there from the last time that I wore it. But if you want to carry it like a bucket, you stick the black straps in and this is how it looks. And it's just so, freaking cool so it's like a two for one type of bag yeah like that it's just so cute it looks like a little shopping bag like i would take this to the store and like put flowers and like a baguette in there but i absolutely love it and i've been using it for work like whenever i'm going somewhere if i'm going to the hq if i'm going to a coffee shop i've been putting my all my stuff in here and it obviously fits everything it goes right over the shoulder super comfortably and then again, if I want to carry it like a bucket bag, I just carry it like this. And it's so fun. The leather is so good. Like you can feel the craftsmanship in this. It's absolutely beautiful. So I absolutely love this bag. I have no idea where she bought it, but I'll Google it and see if I can find this style. They had all different colors that from what she told me. Um, but I like, look at that. It's so cute and just really unique and different, which I love. Now, another bag that I just recently bought and this, I feel like this is me in a bag because my favorite color is blue. I love cool tones. Like I love blues, greens, purples, lavenders, lime greens. Like I love all of that. And I love this texture for the summer. So I saw this and when I tell you, I 
literally gasped. Like I was like, oh, I love that. And this is from a brand called Coast. And I've shopped their brand. They're in store in uh, New York in the, in the Oculus building. Yeah, in the Oculus. Every time I'm in Europe, I always see the store and everything that they do is sustainable. So this, I can't remember, it was like 100% recycled something. But I saw it and the colors, I literally, when I tell you, I was like, I, ha I have to have that. And I literally sat it in my cart and I waited and I waited and I said, you know what? If I'm still thinking about it, whenever the time comes, I will order it. It was $99 and I signed up for their email so I got 10% off. So it ended up being like 89 something after like taxes and all that and I love it. I wore it yesterday. I'll put a picture right here, but I am obsessed. It's just the cutest pouch. Like I, I this, this is me in a bag. If I was a bag, it would be this. I am obsessed with it. It has um, like silver detailing right there and it has that same sturdy type thing as this one. You can obviously see I have a type and it just like snaps shut. I love the slouchiness of it. It carries so much. I used it yesterday. So in here I have my sunglasses. I have a lip oil. I have my AirPods. I had my um, lip combo, my wallet. I had everything in here, but I, you guys, I love this. If they, if they had another color, I would get it too because I am obsessed and it's so beautiful and eye-catching and I'm just obsessed. One more bag and we're done. So the last bag that I have is from a brand called Teddy Blake and I actually worked with them. This is not sponsored by the way. I worked with them around, I think it was like very, very early this year. They sponsored me. They're one of the first companies to like reach out to me and ask if we could do like a, a partnership and they let me pick out a bag and I knew that I wanted a large bag. I was like, I need something for whenever, like if I'm meeting with someone for like a style client, if me and Brendalyn have a meeting, if just anything that is going to hold my laptop and is gonna hold any like documents, folders, anything that I need, my laptop charger, all my stuff. And so I picked this one and I picked it in this color because I wanted to make sure that if we were going somewhere and like I needed something to carry and it matched everything that I had. So I got this like really pretty stone taupe color. This is what it looks like on both sides. The leather is impeccable, you guys. It's such nice, nice quality. And the inside, I have my old wallet in here actually. I was carrying this a lot like in the beginning of the year. I have a nugget in here. I don't even know what else I have in here. Oh, hand cream. It is very spacious and all of this is like a beautiful suede. Both of these pockets are like a loose pocket. So you can see there and it, it's everything. It's a bag that I carry like this, like I carry it next to me. It does have the strap if you are somebody that likes to put it on your shoulder. I don't like carrying really big bags like this over my shoulder because it's just too big. I usually will just do this or I'll hold it like this. And like I said, it carries everything in here. It is so big, so spacious, so soft and luxurious it's just beautiful this is what the detail looks like here it has a little like lock that says teddy blake and a key right in there and there is the logo at the bottom but i love it i would definitely get another bag from them especially their smaller bags very very pretty the leather is absolutely beautiful like i said and yeah i just love it and this is like this was my everyday work bag before brendalyn got me that blue one I hope you enjoyed this video. This is very different. I've never filmed a bag video before. I filmed everything else, shoes, jeans, all that, but I've never filmed bags. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. I will leave all of these styles down below and anything very similar if I can't find that specific style. We'll see you guys in the next video.